Hi everybody and welcome back to Baking with Tiff. Today we are going to be making some apple butter. Um, Carter's Grandma Shell absolutely loves apple butter so we're going to be doing up a couple jars for her and we thought we would share a video with you guys. So to start out with we washed, peeled, and cut about five pounds of gala apples. Do yourself a favor, get you an apple peeler. I'll put some links down below to some different apple peelers online. Um, that way you can get you some and then you know most everybody has one of the uh, uh, the apple slicers that takes the core out. That's just going to make this job a lot easier for you, make it go a lot quicker. So anyways, like I said, we were starting out with the five pounds of gala apples, and then we also put um, one cup of light brown sugar in here, and then this is one tablespoon of cinnamon. It's okay if there's a little bit extra. This doesn't have to be precise at all. Um, a half a tablespoon of nutmeg and a quarter teaspoon of clove, and then just like two dashes of salt and we're just gonna sprinkle this over our apples and we're gonna mix it all in once we get that all combined really well and it's ready to go um, we are going to plug in our crock pot cook it on high for about five hours we're gonna check it periodically and stir them once they're all stirred up and we've let them cook for the five hours um, we're just going to throw this in the blender and blend it up and then put it in some jars and it'll be ready to enjoy on some biscuits or toast or however you see fit. I know some people will make um, spice cakes and uh, like frost it with apple butter. So that's also something that you could try with these. That's good. The apples are all coated. We are ready to plug this in and let it cook again for five hours on high in our crock pot. You guys let me know what you think about this one and happy baking.